The 10th Congressional District of Illinois lies in the northeast corner of the state, and mostly comprises northern suburbs of Chicago. It was created after the 1860 census. The district is currently represented by Democrat Brad Schneider. Topic: 2011 redistricting. The district covers parts of Cook and Lake counties as of the 2011 redistricting which followed the 2010 census. All or parts of Beach Park, Buffalo Grove, Deerfield, Fox Lake, Grays Lake, Highland Park, Lake Bluff, Lake Forest, Lake Villa, Illinois Lindenhurst, Libertyville, Mundelein, North Chicago, Northbrook, Prospect Heights, Round Lake, Round Lake Beach, Vernon Hills, Waukegan, Wheeling and Zion are included. The boundaries became effective on January 3, 2013. Topic. District characteristics Topic. Economy The tenth is home to several Fortune 500 companies, including but not limited to, CDW, Walgreens, Underwriters Laboratories, Baxter Healthcare, AbbVie, Allstate Insurance and Mandela's International. Topic. Military The naval station Great Lakes near North Chicago, hosting the United States Navy's only boot camp, trains 38,000 recruits each year. 5.2% of the district's inhabitants have performed military service. Topic. History The area of the district was originally represented by one of Abraham Lincoln's closest allies, Elihu B. Washburn R. Waukegan. The district was created in 1982 redistricting out of districts represented by John Porter R. Wilmette and Robert McClory R. Lake Bluff. On the retirement of McClory, the district was represented by Porter after winning the elections of 1982, 1984, 1986, 1988, 1990, 1992, 1994, 1996, and 1998. Following Porter's retirement, 11 Republicans and two Democrats ran to succeed him. Eventually nine Republicans and one Democrat stood for election in the primary of March 2000. John Porter's former chief of staff, Mark Kirk, won the Republican primary over No. 2 rival Sean Donnelly. Kirk then defeated State Representative Lauren Beth Gash D. Highland Park by 2% in the 2000 general election. Kirk remained in Congress until he decided to run for the United States Senate in the 2010 election. He was succeeded by Republican Robert Dold. Elections. Topic: 2006 election. Republican candidate for governor Judy Bartopinka and GOP candidate for Cook County Board President Tony Parika both handily won the district in 2006, although both lost in the state and countywide, respectively, count. Topic: 2008 election. Dan Seals, who had previously run against Mark Kirk in 2006, defeated Clinton adviser Jay Footlick for the 2008 Democratic nomination. Dave Kalbfleisch received the Green Party nomination, but was removed from the ballot by the Illinois State Board of Elections. Independent candidate Alan Stevo was also nominated. Mark Kirk defeated Dan Seals in their rematch from 2006 by 54% to 46%, thus winning a fifth term in the House. 2010 election The Republican Party nominee, Robert Dold, won against the Democratic Party nominee, Dan Seals. 2012 election 
Robert Dold no longer lives in the redrawn district, but said he would move into the district if he won re election. Candidates for the Democratic nomination were Ilya Shaman, a community organizer from Waukegan, Brad Schneider, a business consultant, John Tree, a business executive and colonel in the Air Force Reserve, and Vivek Babda, an intellectual property attorney. In the March 20, 2012 primary, Brad Schneider won the Democratic nomination. Schneider defeated Dold in the general election in November. Topic: 2014 election. Brad Schneider, the incumbent, was selected to be the Democratic nominee, and Robert Dold was once again selected to be the Republican nominee. Dold won the election with just over 50% of the vote. Topic: 2016 election. Brad Schneider defeated Highland Park Mayor Nancy Rotering for the Democratic nomination on March 15. Democrat Brad Schneider defeated Republican Robert Dold by nearly 5% votes, the largest victory margin in Illinois' 10th congressional district since redistricting. 2018 election Brad Schneider is expected to seek re-election for a second consecutive term. There were three Republican candidates who ran in the primary, Douglas R. Bennett of Deerfield, who is a computer consultant and vice chairman of the West Deerfield Township Republican Organization, Libertyville physician and business owner Sapin Shaw, and Jeremy Wines of Highland Park. Robert Dold declined to run for a fifth time. On March 20, Douglas Bennett narrowly beat Wines and Shaw in the primary. 2018 Republican primary results Recent election results U.S. President U.S. Representative Topic List of Representatives Topic Living former members of the U.S. House of Representatives from Illinois' 10th Congressional District As of September 2017, three former members of the U.S. House of Representatives from Illinois' 10th Congressional District are alive. The most recent to die was Samuel H. Young on September 23, 2017. The most recently serving representative to die was Abner J. Mikva on July 4, 2016. <laughs> <laughs> Historical district boundaries See also Illinois Congressional Districts List of United States Congressional Districts <laughs>